this is Clint from KC Custom Welding. Happy 2024, everybody. First uh, video of the new year. I, uh, thanks to my wife, have a new camera, and uh, I'll be able to do some action footage. Finally, too, get you guys some shots of how fast my Ninja dirt bike goes. Uh, as far as the Ninja quad, drag quad goes, I'm working on that video, or that for the video today. I uh, have to pull my carbs off. Uh, I made sure that the engine runs good in the chassis. You can check out videos back in the past. But yeah, this bike is built entirely by me. And uh, I'm hoping that uh, I'll hit the seven, sec seven second mark for uh, under $2,000. Which is kind of crazy. But uh, yeah, I guess I get off on going fast and saving money, right? Send it and save money. Anyway, I uh, uh, will be... Uh, doing all the intake manifold and exhaust work on it so I got a lot of work cut out plus the turbo is going to be in the front of the bike so it's going to be a big job a lot of TIG welding a lot of pie cuts yay and uh, yeah anyway better get to work so yeah this is uh, yeah my uh, garage here and Good old ninja. It's uh, yeah, pretty fast for. I just put a couple of little uh, twenty-four mil carbs on it, and yeah, it hauls. So I removed removed the fuel pump, and uh, now I'm just. I'm gonna start by so taking my bag out the carbs there. Unscrewing my carb cables. You can see I got everything jerry rigged. I think it was just just to test how well the <coughs> frame and engine worked more so in the engine. If everything went nice and straight. And yeah, it did. So now it's fuel injection time. Okay. Just lose both the both the carb on the screws holding the carbs in. It's too bad because I uh, I jerry rigged the exhaust kind of half decently to be even, uh, and now I'm gonna cut it all back apart again, but. one as you can see I just made up custom mounts to mount the carb onto the motor which I might end up using these for my uh, turbo system as you can see I did it at a stainless and uh, galvanized unfortunately but uh, they might work for my fuel injection system. There she goes. Turn that around. Okay. So then we got both curves off. Sure, no good now. Okay, so now I am going to pull the exhaust off. Exhaust off. It's crude. 
I'm gonna be cutting it up anyway. I'm gonna be shortening, cutting it right here, shortening them up, making it two, a little short two into one for the turbo. That'll be episode two on this. And uh, yeah, as far as skipping ahead, here's my charge pipe. I measure it up and uh, I'm gonna have two inlets for my intakes right here and here. And I'll plug my end and then have a nice uh, and read my boost pressure right at the end. So I know what I'm getting, and it's just gonna sit in the bike like so. Um, down to the turbo in the front, which will feed it up. Anyway, um, yeah, let's get to it. Send it and save money, like and subscribe.